Mariners looking for the series win as they take on the Oakland A's Sunday afternoon. Luis Castillo made the start today and he would continue his streak of consecutive quality starts going six innings. He gave up two runs on seven hits while striking out eight. The Mariner offense would get on the board in the bottom of the first with one on. It's Mitch Garver with the base hit into center field. That brings home a run and gives the Mariners a 1-0 lead. The M's would continue the trend in the bottom of the second with two on. It's Sam Haggerty with the base hit up the middle. That's going to bring home France as the Mariners take a 2-0 lead. Next batter's Dylan Moore. And Dylan Moore hits a long fly ball to center field. The ballpark's going to hold it, but it's deep enough to score a run as Urias comes in to make it 3-0. Next batter's Julio Rodriguez, and Julio busts out of his slump with a home run to straightaway center field. That's his second of the year as the Mariners go up 5-0. It wouldn't be a Luis Castillo start without giving up a home run. And in the top of the fifth, it's Max Schumann driving one into the A's bullpen and left. That's his second of the year, and it cuts the Mariner lead to 5-1. The Mariners would respond in the bottom half of the fifth with one on. It's Mitch Garver driving one into the beer garden in center field. That's his fifth of the year, and it gives the Mariners a 7-1 lead. The A's would respond in the top half of the sixth when former Mariner Abraham Toro drives one into the right field seats. That's his fourth of the year, and it cuts the Mariner lead to 7-2. The M's would get that run back in the bottom of the sixth when C.B. Savala hits his first home run of the year. That makes it 8-2 Mariners. Then in the top of the eighth, with one on, it's Brett Rooker hitting one into the bleachers in left field. That's his 10th of the year, and it cuts the Mariner lead to 8-4. Then in the ninth, Andres Munoz in to close it out. And with one out and one on, he gets Matt Schumann to bounce into the 4-6-3 double play. That's going to do it. Mariners win this one today, 8-4, and take the series win from the A's. And with the win, the Mariners take a half-game lead over Texas for first place in the AL West. But there's no time to rest for the Mariners as they host the Kansas City Royals for three games starting Monday at 6.40 p.m.